doom. <clears throat> Over here. This was the second uh, Super Nintendo game. It was violent that I remember borrowing from my older cousin. He was about 10 years older than me. It's the only shooter that I played as a kid. I believe I tried uh, Wolfenstein on the computer too at a friend's house. It's a similar game where you fight Nazis. But this game, too. One. Uh, it's a game where you are a guy, a soldier, and um, fight uh, aliens. The computer game is still popular. This is a Super Nintendo game. I actually thought the, the graphics were awesome for the Super Nintendo back in the day. So, so I thought these graphics were awesome when I played it on Super Nintendo back in the 90s. But uh, obviously they are not that great look really outdated now. So the face there, when, when we get hurt, it will get blooded. The 50 ammo. The music is great in this game. Picked up an armor bonus. graphics and such. So they've used, uh, I believe the mods are using an upgraded, an updated engine that enhances the graphics and such. But on the Super Nintendo it looked like this, really outdated and pixelated. Ah, we are firing at Circle. The enemies over there. Ah, uh, these are humans. There are some human enemies too. So these graphics were awesome back when I played it in the 90s. However, I believe they looked slightly better on uh, an old TV. They look worse on a modern computer, I think.
Ah, you got an armor. Good. It's actually more difficult to see the enemies in this version of the game. Because the pixels are so bad. Updated. It's difficult to see the the humans and they are far away. Might be the third stage where we get the shotgun. Music is great in this game. The atmosphere. It was great playing this on the Super Nintendo as a kid. It was really badass the game. There was nothing like it. I mean, Wolfenstein and Duke Nukem existed, but uh, Wolfenstein was, uh, I believe, a PC game, and this was a Super Nintendo game, and then there were Duke Nukem for the PlayStation, I believe. Maybe there were also the Super Nintendo versions of those games, but. I only ever played the Doom game on, on the Super Nintendo. Ah, we've been here already. <coughs> can also fight with our hands. Okay, <clears throat> so this game felt really badass to play, it was like the first shooter I ever played, so it was really cool to play it as a kid. I played nothing like it, prior to it. It's like a shooter but only single player, I believe there were no multiplayer in Doom 1. In the computer version there is multiplayer I believe, but not in the... Super Nintendo version of the game. Could be wrong about the computer version, of course. I remember there was an area where we needed like a card to unlock a door or something. I no idea where we're supposed to go here. Here's the shotgun they wanted. So it goes on this stage, the second stage. It's really badass. It's my favorite weapon. I only played maybe four stages or so. Couldn't finish the fourth or so stage. Stage with a lot of demons, including new, bigger pink demons. Okay, I don't know where we are. 
Oops, I lost it. Go. Sidestep. L1 and R1. Picked up a clip. Nice. That might be what you need to open a locked door. I just need to find that locked door too. Yeah, the, the music in this game is, is great. Very atmospheric. And another clip. Nice. Up. 
Fuck the gunfire. Good. And one shot these guys. Help with the shotgun. Alive. More than one. Go and kill them. So Doom 1 is actually still one of the most popular games on mod B, the modding site. I believe that the mod for this game is still uh, in the top 5 games and used to be top one for a very very long time. I never played the mod. But it's using a, an upgraded engine, better graphics, better enhanced features. Where the fuck is the enemy? Very 
damaged again. We need the mad pack. We have a mad pack, good. Steam pack, actually. Yeah, this game is actually still fun. It's just that as a kid I <clears throat> I didn't really care much about the monsters and such. I believe as an adult <laughs> I uh, uh, chicken out more for the, the scary games. But this is not a scary game. It's more like um, what should I say? It's like shooter, but uh, a weird shooter. Well, it has some bits that could uh, surprise you. Armor. Kill that guy too. Now we need a med pack again, we're almost dead. Kill two more. Kill another one there. We're almost dead, we can't move very fast. Heal those guys too, very good. We need a med pack, they're almost dead.
numbers this time. The shots. Right, so this is the stage, it was pink beasts, then I don't know if I have ever finished this stage, I don't think so. This is as far as I uh, came and uh, came. But I replayed the first two stages over and over again, I believe, and this stage, but I couldn't beat it, I believe. And I played it. stage. I don't believe I finished this stage before. Maybe. I'm wrong. I might have finished this one too. Okay. Might be this one that I didn't finish in the past or it was the previous one. I don't know.
guy.
go there. Okay, thank you for watching. Don't want to play anymore.